Good morning, boys and girls. Welcome to Shen Plays. Welcome back to the land of Game Dev Tycoon. We've had some floppy-ish games lately, so we developed a new engine with 3DV5. Hopefully that helps. I, I mean, it'll be better than nothing, that's for damn sure. Uh, we're making a new game here for mature audiences, the Mbox 360, the PC, and the GS on the Baguette Cube 5. I know that's supposed to be a V, but you know what? 5 is 5 is 5. It's not the big deal. Uh, need a new name here, though, and Twitch chat is coming up with names right now. Two girls, one rock. Two and a half lines. Back on crack. Bueller date night. Hostage situation. Eh. Uh, I think two and a half lines works. Alright, so it's a medium game for mature audiences, comedy, adventure, just single genre should be fine. Could do something else, but no, I think adventure is fine. Uh, it's kind of weak on the GS and kind of weak on the 360, but it's perfect for the PC and mature audiences are going to be pretty well met except on the GS. The GS is eh, not so great, but it'll do. Let's do it. And does it need good graphics? Adventure game needs decent graphics. We'll go with 3D V4. Oh, that's the problem, isn't it? If we do 3D V5, we get the new graphics, but we won't be able to fit it all into the game because we just won't. <laughs> uh, the last phase, stage three, when you actually do graphics, you're supposed to focus mostly on world design and graphics is like a, kind of a secondary thing. So looks like we're going to do 3D V4, even though we just developed 3D V5. <laughs> uh, oh, well. Them's the breaks. Oh shit, Bryson needs a break. Well, tough shit, Bryson. We just started a game, you son of a bitch. God, if you needed the potty, you should have done that before we started. Okay, what are we doing for the first phase? Is minimum, almost, minimum, medium, and almost max. Minimum, medium, and max. Perfect. So, can we fit all this shit in? You bet your ass we can fit all this shit in. Oh, we have new shit as well. We won't be able to fit any of this stuff, though. Looks like all we can do is a save game. That's... Jeez, that's terrible. Can we fit multiplayer at all? Oh, we can do multiplayer as well. Uh, there. Okay, save game and multiplayer. Come on, 98, 100. Okay, fine. Good enough. What about this? Gameplay, we're not going to be able to do achievements. Maybe get rid of character progression? Oh, there we go. Now we can do achievements. Great. So no, no character progression. It's a comedy game. Who cares? Uh, who's going to do all the work, though? That's a good question. 20, uh, mostly tech. Maybe Caesar, give Caesar some work? Sure, Caesar, you got you got a job again. And who's gonna do this? Design and design, 80-80. Well, I think Eric can do this, we'll boost him. It should be fine. Go for it, Eric. Oh, he doesn't have a boost yet. He will, soon. Ah, Eric! Oh my god, large booth, yes. Eric. There you go. We hit the boost. Thank God. It's not like the boost lasts very long. Oh, phew. You got it all in. That's what she said? Anyway, so what the R&D lab does when you're not researching anything is it generates research points. So that's nice. Okay, next phase. Adventure maximum, medium, minimum. Okay, maximum, medium, minimum. Great. Uh, how much shit can we... We can fit everything. Nice. Can we fit minigames? Uh, if we wiggle this a bit. Wiggle, 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 wiggle. Yeah, there you go. And AI. Well, we can't really fit any, any of this, so screw it. No AI. Sorry. Level design and dialogues are everything here. So who's going to do this? It's 90%. Who's my best? I should have saved that for Eric, but apparently I'm a moron. So who wants to do Eric's job? Maybe... Lori? Sure. I mean, I guess. I, I don't have anyone better for the task, except maybe Rena. But uh, it's going to be Lori. Okay. She does not have very good design, but it's better than most of our staff. And we're not going to hype the game. Sure as fuck don't need to hype the game. The G3 coming. People are already suggesting scores. We haven't even finished yet, and people are already suggesting scores. Someone's saying 11 out of 10. No way. Someone's saying 1 out of 10. That's probably very likely. Someone's saying a negative 2 out of 10. 
I think you might be right on nail on the head there. Number one booth, though. So despite making shitty games lately, we are the most popular game company in the world. Isn't that nice? You make shitty games. I love you. <laughs> That's pretty amazing. We're the number one booth two years in a row despite making crappy games. Well, I mean, from my point of view, they're not crappy games, but whatever. All right, max, almost max, medium, max, almost max, medium. Oh, we need those graphics. Uh, good enough. I guess we get rid of the soundtrack and just do stereo sound. There you go. Uh, world design, can we fit all that shit? No, we cannot. Well, what do we get rid of? We don't need the virtual economy. Maybe we do? Oh, we can do it if we get rid of open world. Um, no, we need the open world. With the day and night cycle? Sure. Nine point nine two, six point five, five point oh, eight point seven five, nine point seven five. We're way off. Everyone's just all over the place. Wow. All right, can we get Rena any more work? There we go. Ninety five, ninety five. Okay, that's fine. That's pretty balanced. Let's do it. And Bryson, holy shit, do you need a break, my friend? Well, as soon as we're done, not not before then, Bryson. Holy shit, we're under fifty million. Ah. Uh. Send gifts to the reviewers? I don't think you can do that. <laughs> oh my god, 450 hype. And the M-Box is coming off the market. And the G-Sphere is coming off the market. But, look at this, Ninvento has a new game uh, console coming out called the New. So what's interesting about the New is it's really good for uh, simulation and casual games. And it targets the young and, and everybody audiences. EPA. What is this? Uh, you can install solar panels. Yeah, okay. Sure. That's cheap. Alright, Bryson. Get the fuck out of here. Oh my god. He's just sitting there throwing tantrums. He probably punched a hole in his monitor. Uh, Bryson is not having a good day, man. Yes. Okay, finish it. And what do we want to do? Oh, there we go. Hey, we got a record on design. Nice. Can now do realistic weather. Game report time? Sure. There we go. And, oh, the reviews are in already. Jesus. Okay. Well, they like it. They certainly like it. Uh, it's not the best game ever, though. Oh, we, got a, we got an 8! We got an 8, not bad. Did anyone say 8? We did. We did have someone say 8. We had probably lots of people say 8. Um, actually, no. It looks like only... No, two people. Mr. Kong123 and Hey Green 2 We had two people say 8s. Look at that. Two people in Twitch chat got it exactly right. Not half bad. So before I do that, I want to do some research here. I mean, not research. I want Eric to become a specialist. Can we do that? Specialist? Specialist? How do we make him a fucking... Oh, he needs more points, doesn't he? Shit, he needs more technology to become a specialist. Okay, get some tech. But not too much. Lori, can you use some training? see specialist yeah no she needs more research man and we'll save our 200 points hey George go on vacation hey a rank 11 game not bad game sphere no longer supported yeah rank 11 game is not bad considering it only got an eight right The newest game in the series, titled blah blah blah, had a newer engine than the original, really driving technical innovation. Fantastic. And the sales are pretty good. Sold more than a million copies already, I'll take that. Any day of the week. Alright, are you fucking done yet, dude? How many points do you fucking need? 
He needs, let's see, 720 and 180 to be like a gameplay specialist or a story specialist, a dialogue specialist. He could do a dialogue specialist, but we don't really have many games that do dialogues heavily, do we? Well, if we do RPGs, probably. Uh, yeah, RPGs. Let's do some RPGs. We'll make them a dialogue specialist. That sounds good. If we use their boost while they're training, they get more points. Okay. Uh, oh, I can't make him a dialogue specialist? Why not? Why can I not make him a dialogue specialist? He's level 6, and he has the required design and tech. Hold on. Train. Dialogue specialist. It says it needs 810 design and 90 tech. He has 900 design and 100 tech. He needs level 7? Are you kidding me? He needs to be a level 7? Okay. Okay. Understood. Understood. Fuck. Okay, then. It looks like we're going to have people do some more training. Why don't you go on vacation? Uh, do some training, George. George, George, George of the George, 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 more training, more, more research for you. Everyone needs research, man. Everyone needs research. Holy crap. I feel like if we had if we had been focusing on research a lot earlier, we would have had a ton more points right now. I feel like kind of a dummy. But only kind of a dummy, because part of it is Twitch chat's fault. I'm gonna keep poking my finger at Twitch chat and going, Neener neener neener, it's all your fault. Neener neener neener, it's all your fault. Neener neener neener, neener neener neener. Um <laughs> Get Bryson some work. We never use him. We should use Bryson. Kind of feel bad for not using him, but eh. hey, the new is out. Probably should make some games for that thing. Uh, new. Yep. Simulation and casual. Really good for everybody and young audiences. Okay. Made 19 million in sales off that game. Not half bad. It is your fault, Darabelle18940. It is. I'm glad you acknowledge it. Twitch chat is finally acknowledging their presence. Shen Hate says, no, we don't. <laughs> okay, we're done. All right, let's make another game. Let's make another sequel. Uh, another hacking game. Another yap game. Oh, we need a sequel, Young Guns. Yeah, we do. There's our RPG. Perfect. Wild West. Let's see if that's going to be good. Uh, Wild West is RPG-tastic, and it's meant for young audiences. So what's good for young, or, or mature, we could do mature audiences. What's good for young? The new, but the new is terrible with RPG. Uh, the Game Sphere, oh, the Game Sphere is perfect. Look at that, it's absolutely perfect for young audiences and RPGs. But it looks like the Mbox 360 is not, and the PS2 is not. Damn. Kind of a weird mixture here. It, we could do everybody, I guess, but that's not a good mixture either. The PS3 would be preferable. Save that for the new console, for the new, the new consoles. We could. I'm thinking of doing a large game just for shits and giggles. Let's just try it, man. Fucking large game. Uh, on the 360 and the PC. I put it on the PC first. Hold on. There you go. PC first, and then the 360, and then is it the PS2 or the GS? Hmm. PS2, probably. We'll just make it for everybody instead of young. The difference being, if we do it for everybody, it's really good on the PS2, and it's okay on the PC, and it's... Uh, oh, we could do the GS. Hmm. No, I think everybody's just the better category. Just because it's... It, 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 yeah, it's fine. It's fucking fine, man. Fuck. On the back at Cube 5. Large game time. Need a name here. Young Guns 
three. If we make it a mature game, what does that change for the PC? Oh, the Making a mature game is perfect for the PC. It's terrible for the PS2 and perfect for the 360. So if we take it off the PS2, we could put it on the GS, but it's terrible for the... The GS is terrible at mature games. We could put it on the new, but the new is terrible at mature games. And that's just the problem we're running into. It's like there's no real system. The Dream Vast, but that's not out anymore. Uh, the PS3, but that's not out yet. <laughs> I think we'll just do it for everyone. All right, what do we got? The hostage situation. Puberty shoots first. Good morning, people. I, I think that's more of a hello to the stream. <laughs> uh, pubic years. Nah. The third game. Nah. Don't drop the soap. No, we're not in prison. Now, uh, 360's out, but the PS3 is not out yet. Just put it on two platforms. That's true. All right. Yeah. All right. We'll just put on two platforms. We'll make it a mature game. That way it'll be more specialized. Probably get better score, too. Billy the Elder. Billy the Adult. Premature detonation. I don't know. The hostage situation. College blast. College Blast? <laughs> nope, can't do it. <laughs> can't do it. Shen Dead Redemption? What? Sequel Derpier Than Light? We can sequel Derpier Than Light at some point. Billy the Billy? Dalton Terror? Wildfire? The Large Shootout? Wow, we got some terrible suggestions today. Twitch chat, you're you're disappointing. I give, today I give Twitch chat a, a 4 out of 10. And I'm not sure if I should, I'm not sure if that should be a thumb up or a thumb down. These suggestions, man. We'll call it, uh, well, it's a big game, right? This is the first large game we're gonna make. We'll call it uh, Bigger, Badder, and, uh, what, what's it? Bigger, Badder, Boldlier. Boldlier, perfect. Bigger, Badder, Boldlier, it's gonna happen. Uh, next. Uh, now, I'm not sure we can fit every... Oh, of course we can. It's a large game. Of course we can fit 3D V5. Uh, let's make sure that's what we want, though. A large, mature game, Wild West, RPG, PC, and Mbox 360. That is a very good combination. So, yeah, great combo. It's like, woohoo, great combo. And let's do it. Bigger, badder, boldlier. Yes. All right, who's going to do our, our work here? RPGs. We haven't done one of these, one of these in a while is almost minimum and then almost max and max almost minimum almost max and then max now one of the nice things about doing a large game is we can fit a whole lot more shit into every game so look at this we can fit everything in here even the very expensive one that's exp the expense when it says k that is the amount of money that you have to put in to put that into the game but what it means is this takes a long time so you have to fund it this amount of funds for that many weeks that it's going to take to finish it, or that many days, or whatever. Uh, engine. We can't really fit a whole lot into the engine. Can we fit video playback? Nope. Can we do physics? Nope. Can we do mod support? Uh, maybe, but I think that's going to be a little too much in the game. I think we'll just tone it down a bit. We'll just get rid of that, and we'll do save game and multiplayer. That's fine. There you go. Just the minimum funding possible to get those in. There you go. And we should be able to fit, yeah, branching story and advanced cutscenes. Very good. So who's going to do all of this work? Who's going to do all of this work? Well, the first phase is almost all tech. 
Caesar is our best at almost all tech, so he can keep doing that. And look at that, even though this is like almost no investment at all, it's already 18% of his workload. That's crazy because it's a large game. And gameplay is gonna be almost all design. Well, Eric, you can't do both. He can't even do both. It's just too much. So we'll have, who's gonna do some of this work? Maybe Lori can do some of this. Maybe even Baguette. No, we'll have, maybe Bryson. We never use Bryson anymore. No, we'll, we'll use Lori. All right, Lori, you're gonna do the gameplay. Okay, good luck, Lori. And if you disappoint us, I'm gonna fucking fire you, okay? So don't disappoint us, Lori. Please don't disappoint us. Uh, minimum, almost max, and max. Got it, let's go. And we'll give Eric his boost, because why not? Eric needs to be dialogue? Oh, you, you are a good point there. Why didn't I save dialogue? I'm a dum-dum. The problem is dialogue is very important for RPGs. And dialogue is 90% design, which would have been perfect for Eric. Oh, shit. Information on your current game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. What do you want? Uh, should we hype this? You know what? I'm going to be modest. We have had so many bad hyped games. Oh, shit. We just started a game and Caesar's already freaking out. Fucking hell, Caesar. He's like, sorry, man. <laughs> oh, shit, Caesar. Okay, phase two. Maximum, almost max, and medium. Maximum, almost max, and medium. So how much shit can we fit in here? Well, pretty much everything. No, we can't fit all the AI stuff. Or maybe we can? Mm, no, that's that's really too much investment. We'll do just um, RPG. We don't need the AI. We need the companions. It's too bad we can't fit anything else. We need some more choices. Next time we have things that are available to research, let's see if we can research some AI. Because these two options are just not enough. I need some more options in here for like cheaper stuff, like 21k or 43k. I don't want it to always be the really expensive ones, because they're hard to fit this in. That's what she said. All right, who's going to do the work here? Uh, who's got 90% dialogues? Well, I would love that to be Eric, but he's already overworked. Uh, let me ask really quick. Uh, does anyone know if we put Eric to 146% workload, does that give us a worse score? I mean, I've never had a definitive answer on this, but I'm really curious. Yes, okay, that ruins our score. So we won't do that then. Oh, that sucks. So who's going to fucking do this? This is really important to the game, and I really want Eric to do it, but we can't make him do it. It's just too much work. Then again, this is a large game, so I'm not sure if we can do this. Who can we put on this? Maybe Bryson? Who can we do this? Let's put Rena on it, since this is so important. And maybe maybe Eric can do something somewhat somewhat not important at the very end. Maybe Eric can do sound at the end, because sound isn't that important. Okay. Uh okay, okay, okay. Let's get Georgie on some of this here. Because why not? Uh, and can Georgie also do level design? Yes, he can. Okay, Georgie's going to do all of his work this phase. That's perfect. I like that. I like that a lot. Georgie's got 100% and he's super happy to do this part of the, of the design here. Now, we're not going to hype it because we shouldn't need to. We have a large booth at G3 coming up. That's all the hype we're going to need. Man, I hope we get a good score here. Oh, shit. We have three people who need a vacation. Well, we'll see if we can do that after this game. All right, here comes the PS3 coming. It's too bad it wasn't out yet, because the PS3 is pretty good for... Uh, the PS3 is pretty good with, with mature games, so that would have been nice. All right, here comes G3. It's going to be like an extra 400 hype or something. It's ridiculous. We have the largest booth every year now. No, oh, come on. We're 124 people off of a million. Ah, whatever. Close enough. Number one booth! Okay, last phase, RPG. Maximum. Almost max and medium. Okay, who, who's going to do this work? Can we get Eric in there at all? Nope, it's going to be 121% if we do that. Alright, well, it looks like Eric is done. 
Who's going to do these? These are 60, 50, 60. Uh, Bryson can do some work this phase. Bryson, you want to do these two? That works. And then who's going to do this one? Maybe Baguette? Sure. There you go. Uh, it's not the best... It's not the best decision ever. Let me get Rena in there, maybe? Well, how much shit can we fit in here anyway? Can we fit that? Oh, 97, 96. That's pretty good. I think I can live with that. That way we get really good graphics. Uh, we get really good graphics, and we get stereo and a soundtrack in there. And we can fit the day and night side. We can fit everything in world design. Um, I'm not sure I like that Rena's overworked, though. I think we'll go back to Bryson for this, just because he'll be he'll be on curve, right? 102% is very much on curve. 100% there we go. Alright, looks good. Let's do it. Maybe bring that down to there, okay. Sound at 90 and graphics at 100 percent That'll work. Do it. Man, that's a lot of hype. This game better be good. <laughs> that's a lot of hype. And if Eric levels up, we can make him a design specialist now. Or not a design, a dialogue specialist now. If he levels up. Ding. There's only 130 bugs. That's not a lot. That's a lot. Oh my god, 500 hype. We didn't even market it. We did no marketing. We have 500 hype. All right, ratings. I want to hear ratings, everybody. It was a piece of shit. 10 out of 10. <laughs> All right, what do we got? We got 9, 9.25, 7.5, 9.25, 8.75, 9, 8, 9, 1, 8, 7, 9 out of 9. 9 out of 9? What? <laughs> Only 130 bugs. <laughs> 10 out of 10. 8.5, 9.25, 9.25. We'll see, we'll see. Okay, Eric did level up. So I'm going to go ahead and make him a specialist before we go anywhere nuts. Uh, interactive story, more choices, orchestral soundtrack. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, we can now do AAA games. Okay, but first, uh, you are going to become our dialogue specialist. Good job, Eric. You're being promoted. And that's 5 million credits, million dollars, and pretty much all of our research points. Uh, I'm going to get some more training, I think, on Georgie here. He needs a little more design, but also more tech. I'm going to go for the tech, actually. And let's start getting some vacations going. Let's go on vacation. Oh, reviews are in for Young Guns 3, bigger, badder, and boldlier. Come on, tens. Yeah. Come on, tens. Yeah! Oh ho 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 ho! Yes! All games, don't screw me now! All games, you son of a bitch! You motherfucking piece of shit! What the hell? Oh, for fuck's sake! All games, you piece of crap! Ah, all games. All games. All games. All games. <laughs> never gonna live this down. Every time we get 10, 10, 10, and then the last one's always a 9. Always. Fucking all games. Oh, crap. Alright, let's do some contract work in the meantime. I need to cool off for a bit there. That was brutal. That was brutal. Should be a really well selling game, though. Number two game in the world. Not bad. And first week we sold over a million copies. First week. Nice. Are you not on vacation? Go on vacation. I can't believe how much that's selling. Well, I tell you what, that means we're going to put the R&D lab all the way up because we can. <laughs> oh no, we failed a contract. I don't care. This game doesn't just tell a story. No, it manages to draw you in so that you truly feel part of an adventure. Young Guns 3, bigger, badder, boldly, really deserves the top spots in the charts. Tom Mott. And the V3 is not out yet. Oh, or the PS3 is coming out later this month. Great. I'm glad it's coming out. More contract work, please.
More contract work, please. There it is. The PS3 is out. Now we're up. We're over $100 million. Holy crap, we've sold 4.9 million copies of that one damn game. Go on vacation, dude. Uh, more contract work. Why don't you do the game report? There you go. Actually, let's make uh, Eric do it. Since he's done being a dialogues expert. Oh my god, 5 million copies have sold. Not half bad. Wow, 9 weeks for that. Okay. Now we need to make a game that includes the PS3 and the Mbox 360. Oh my god, the sales. Old engine. Yeah, you can have that. Fucking have it. I don't need that piece of shit. Vacation. Alright, so everyone's going on vacation at like the same time. That's perfect. And the last contract. Good. Alright, and it's time for a new game. Alright, now do we want to go with a sequel or just a straight up new game? Wow, I'm so glad we sequeled that. Holy shit. Get a graphics expert? Uh, well, we did just get a dialogues expert. I would like to start off with an expert for each phase. So dialogues is phase two. Uh, graphics is phase three. So yeah, we could do a graphics expert. What do we need for that? Well, hold on one sec. Let me just take a look. Right. Graphics is 450 and 450. Oh yeah, we could do that. Uh, Lori has that and so does Rena. Is she level seven yet? No, she's level six. All right, so when Rena goes level seven, we'll make her the graphics expert. That's fine. And we also should get some boost. Let's get some boost going. Oh. Why can't we do her boost? Oh, she doesn't have 500 design. Well, go get 500 design, my friend. I feel kind of embarrassed that you don't have it. Boost. Oh, come on, I'm trying to click on a person, game. Boost. I don't think Barry or Bryson has anything. No, his stats are terrible. Uh, sure, get some more design. And wow, our main character is just garbage. Well, looks like we need some more main character buffs. And in the meantime, there's no contract work, so I don't know what Eric's going to do. Eric, just sit on it and spin, my friend. Go on vacation. Holy shit! $95 million on Young Guns 3. What? What? Oh my god. You know what, though? That's going to be the end of this episode. Thank you guys for joining me. I have been Shen. You have been you. We are pumping out the research. We might have to tone that back now that we have... Uh, ended sales of that wonderful game. 95 million dollars from one game. Alright, I'll see you guys next time where we'll be making some more games and we're probably going to, well, if we can double this cash, then I'd think about then it's time to put out our own console. So hopefully we can make another maybe another two hit games like that. Another two hit games would really put us in a position to release our own console. But that'll have to be next time. I'll see you then. Have a good day.